Hi guys. Uh, hope you're wondering like what's happening here, where am I, and what's all these things around. Uh, right now I am here in Hampi Heritage and Wilderness Resort here in Hampi, uh, which is a UNESCO World Heritage Site here in Karnataka. I'm here on some personal work, and uh, the most important thing is, last night I got to own my personal copy of Panasonic Lumix GH5. So I thought I'll carry it along with me. I use it in my shoot here uh, for the next few days and try out in the real world how it feels like, how it performs and all those things. Though I know the answer, I just wanted a reason to carry it along with me. But I thought like, uh, instead of opening it last night and see what's there and all those stuff, I thought I'll do unboxing in front of you guys so that you also get to see what I see, what's packaged inside this beautiful black box and let's see uh, what's inside and let's get started. Double layer packaging. Seriously, wonder why people put so many layers of plastic. Really interesting. Okay. So, for your information, this is basically a kit model, not the body only. I wanted to personally use and try out this new 1260 lens so i went for the kit option uh, unlike the uh, the previous version which i have which is gh4 uh, this is not a 1235 f2.8 lens which comes as a kit this is a 1260 f2.8 to f4 lens that comes with this uh, kit All the optional accessories that comes along with GH5 are listed here. Some of the things I did mention in my uh, GH5 Bangalore event, uh, especially things like the audio adapter and the, uh, the lens adapter that comes up, the mics. What's this? Okay, this is the warranty card. Uh, this comes with a two year warranty and I did hear from my uh, store representative that uh, we need to register it online to get hold of the uh, two year warranty so there is no need of all these cards as such but we need to do it online. Okay. Wow. A lot of instruction manuals. Uh, I think there is a quick start guy and a basic operating instruction manual in this. I'll just come back to this in a moment because I have something important to tell about this. The hood, the lens. There you go. 1216 lens. Pretty solid compared to the 1235 that I already have. Uh, this feels much bigger and actually it's heavy compared to that. Okay. The usual autofocus and manual uh, focus knobs and the power OIS. And apparently, uh, this lens is capable of enabling the dual IS that the Panasonic GH5 comes with. The hood for that very important when you're shooting in against the sun and things like that. Okay. I'm outdoors, so all the things are flying around me. Okay. You can probably turn around and see what's happening. You can see a lot of birds flying around, and it's, it's quite chippy out here. I'm not sure if you're able to hear that. 
the strap wow the main thing i'll just see what else is there before i open this lot of cables okay yeah. this is a charger for the battery charger that comes with GH5 and the adapter the power adapters for them the battery itself apparently this is the same battery what the GH4 also uses so I have quite a lot of them uh, spare with me but this will be very handy. The battery performance of GH4 was really very good and I've heard that even the GH5 has fantastic battery response. So this will be something which I'll be uh, able to try out over the next few days, uh, the shoot here. See how the battery performs when I'm doing a full day shoot with just one single battery. Okay, some more adapter. Okay, this probably is a HDMI lock port if I am right yeah okay this is something what you use to uh, make sure that your HDMI cable uh, is placed securely when you're uh, using an external record or anything uh, Panasonic has packed this along with the camera itself interesting okay USB type C uh, data cable some more power adapters for different countries uh, this is mainly for the India and Europe type of thing and this is I presume for US okay let's keep this aside let's go to the camera quickly Panasonic Lumos GH5. Wow, it feels much heavy and more robust than the GH4. Okay. Both screen. And I, uh, if you remember, I did mention in my uh, the GH5 event the first thing that anyone will notice is the absence of the pop-up flash uh, in this camera so there's no more pop-up flash you might have to use a hot shoe along with a wireless adapter or any of the Panasonic uh, external flashes if you want if you really want to use a flash feels nice let's mount the lens Though it's a mirrorless camera, this particular combination, which is the GH5 with the 1260, does feel like a DSLR with a heavy lens. It's really very uh, solid and very comfortable to hold on. I'm, I'm pretty sure I'll enjoy it over the next few days or probably the, over the next few years when I'm using this, especially when I'm shooting handhold. I'm, I'm not much of a handhold shooter. I, pref uh, I prefer using tripod for most of my shoot in respect of video or photo. But if you're someone who uses it handled, I'm pretty sure you'll enjoy the ergonomics of it. Okay, it's the second most important thing, dual SD card slot. That's the most uh, important change uh, that the GH5 comes with when compared to the GH4 or any other cameras in this price range. That's it. I don't want to talk much about the uh, outside features of the GH5. I'll keep it aside for a different video because right now you are seeing this in a 360 degree video. And I'm not sure if you'll be able to appreciate a lot of the stuff uh, that I want to explain here in this camera. So I'll have a dedicated video and probably in the coming weeks about the external features and the comparison between the GH5 and the GH4. So that's a different video altogether. But uh, as I mentioned, I want to give a quick uh, note about the manual. So the camera comes with a quick start guide, uh, this is in English and this one, I'm not sure which language, there's another language here, ok, 
okay and again the operating instruction manual in three different languages but this is the main important one which is English okay so one thing I got to read in the net as well as uh, uh, hear from some of my friends out there in uh, US is that though this manual looks a bit bulky and big uh, there is one important information in this manual uh, there's a specific page I'll try to link it in the show notes below that gives you a reference to an online material which is a much bigger manual which has from intricate level information about this particular uh, camera how to use it how to set it and all those stuff so not many of the people whom I know have the habit of uh, reading the manuals but I would suggest always before you start using the camera always for once read the complete manual and um, whether I can call it uh, good luck or bad luck there is one additional uh, manual available online which is much bigger probably I heard it's over 300 to 400 pages which is probably more than what this particular uh, this is about 120 pages and that one is about 300 plus pages that one is quite important as what I heard uh, there is a lot of information about the autofocus settings and which is one of the thing of debate uh, the last few weeks so please make sure that you go through the manual and also the online manual that's available on the Panasonic website before you start using the camera. I, I know it, it's, you might have to spend quite a bit of time when you're doing that but uh, it's really helpful for you. But I'll also make sure that I'll try to make a video about all the important things which you might tend to miss out uh, when you're using this camera and all the information that I find it's very helpful for you guys um, which I come across either in this manual or the online version. So there you have it, Panasonic Lumix GH5, uh, first 360 degree unboxing of it uh, in the world and it's about 6.15 here uh, in the morning and sun is rising, probably you can turn around and have a look at it and I think it's time for me to get out of the room and head out to the field and start shooting it. Luckily I have my uh, other batteries charged up and I have my memory cards ready so I can start using it. Okay, the birds are telling that enough of it. Let's go. Thank you.